Holy Father, Physician of souls and bodies, who sent your only begotten Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, who heals every infirmity and delivers from death, heal also your servant Mary from the infirmities of body and soul which afflict her, and enliven her with the grace of your Christ, through the prayers of our most holy lady, the Theotokos, and of our Virgin Mary, through the intercessions of the honorable bodiless powers of heaven, through the power of the precious and life-giving cross, through the protection of the honorable, glorious prophet, forerunner, and Baptist John, of the holy, glorious, and most blessed apostles, of the holy, glorious, victorious martyrs of our venerable and God-bearing fathers, of the holy and mercenary physicians, Cosmos and Damien, Cyrus and John, Pantalaemon and Hermolaios, Samson and Diomedes, Photius and Anicetus, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, of Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints. For you are the fountain of healing, O our God, and to you we give glory, to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. <coughs> is anointed in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Spirit. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. God, who loves mankind, compassionate and greatly merciful, abundant in mercy and rich in goodness, Father of mercies and God of all consolation, who through the apostles has given us power to heal the infirmities of your people through oil and prayer. Make this oil to be for the healing of those who are anointed with it, for relief from every disease and all sickness, for deliverance from evil of those who hope in who in hope awaits salvation from you. Yea, O Master, Lord our God Almighty, we entreat you to save us all. O only physician of our souls and bodies, sanctify us all. You who heal every disease, heal also your servant Mary, and raise her up from the bed of sickness through the mercies of your kindness. Visit her with your mercy and compassion. Remove from her every illness and infirmity, so that having been raised up by your mighty hand, she may serve you with all thanksgiving, and that we too, who now share in your ineffable love for humanity, may him and glorify you. For you have performed great and wondrous deeds, extraordinary and glorious. For you are merciful and save us, O Lord our God. And to you we give glory, together with your only begotten Son and your all holy and good and life giving spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Have mercy on us, O God, according to your great mercy. We pray. Hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, and salvation, and remission of sins for the handmaiden of the Lord Mary. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. She may be pardoned every transgression. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. For you are a merciful God who loves mankind. And to you we give glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and into ages and ages. Amen. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and into ages and ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. May Christ our true God, through the prayers of the Most Holy Mother, through the power and precious and life giving cross of the Holy Ghost, and praiseworthy Apostle James, the first Bishop of Jerusalem and brother of God, and of all the saints, have mercy upon us and save us, for as much as he is good. Yeah.
Christ is in your midst. Christ is in your midst. Christ is in your midst. As it never shall be. The Son of our God is mercy.